Pretending to be Thank filming crews and actually stealing All Japanese right. bonsai trees. True shop. Uh, well, it's one just around the corner. I should be careful, though. Good morning. I beg your pardon? I said good morning. Ah, good morning to you, sir. Mr. Dalliard, we have a gentleman in the shop. I've parried his opening remark and we are now having a pleasant conversation. Mr. Dalliard will be joining us as soon as it's likely. Oh. <laughs> well, indeed, sir, good morning. Though, of course, one says good morning, does one not, Mr. Uh, Pardo? One says good morning, does one not, Mr. Jowett? But, in fact, if you were <laughs> kind enough to look outside the door, which is conveniently situated just over there, for Christ's sake, you will see that it is far from a good morning. It is, in fact, rather wind... Tree. Um, yes, I suppose it is rather. Very, yeah. very win. Trish. Indeed. <laughs> so, from win. Trinus to you, young Master Jarrett, how may we serve? Well, I was after a pair of shoes. Ah, very well, I shall serve them first. <laughs> no, 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 I, um, I, I was, I was looking for a pair of shoes. To buy? To buy. Mr. Deliard, the gentleman wants to buy a pair of shoes. Really? Oh, what rotten decomposing luck. Mr. Deliard tells me we have no shoes. Oh, I must say, you've got very good hearing. I beg your pardon? <laughs> well, I, I couldn't hear your Mr. Deliard at all. My Mr. Deliard? Yes, the fellow who was, um... Oh, sir, I've confused you. Have you? Yes, I should make it clearer than a Waterford bedpan that he is not <laughs> my Mr. Deliard. He's everybody's Mr. Dalliard. A gift to the nation, if you like. As much my Mr. Dalliard as your Mr. Dalliard. Or, dare I say it, and I think I dare, Graham Gooch's Mr. Dalliard. <laughs> Graham Gooch? So it looks, sir, as if you've come to exactly the wrong place. I advise you to leave by the door, which is still conveniently situated just over there, for Christ's sake. Walk 17 paces to your left and turn into the small shoe shop that you will find next to a branch of Finley's. The tobacco people. You mean, you mean this isn't a shoe shop? Good Lord and lots else besides no, Mrs. Jowett. But <laughs> this is a place where people come to meet and talk privately in an intimate, informal atmosphere with a view to a massage or several rounds of sexual intercourse. <laughs> what? This is a place where people... You mean, you mean this is a brothel? I dislike the word brothel, Mr. Jowett. I prefer the word brothels. Yes, this is a brothels. But, but what about the shoes? Shoes? Well, these. Those are my prostitutes, Mr. Jowett. <laughs> prostitutes? Well, you, you mean people pay to have sex with these? Very much, of course, they pay, Lady Jowett. <laughs> I am not a charitable organisation, much though the evidence may point to my being reasonably tall. <laughs> well, lots of people? Ah, I fancy I detect a wrinkle of concern in your otherwise smooth and tobogganable brow. <laughs> yes, your intimations are right. Business is not what it was. It is not even what it is. It may not even be what it will be. We shall see. If it... Mr. Dalliard, I've started to talk drivel now. <laughs> mean to say, really, having sex with shoes. Sir? Well, it seems very... 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 Well, very... Well, very... Oh, I don't know. Yes, it does. It seems very... Oh, I don't know, doesn't it, sir? I mean, I mean this. Frederica is perhaps the most popular moccasin in this brothel, sir. Well, I grant you the lining. 20 but... pounds. What? You have just inserted your hand right into Frederica's most intimate interior pocket. <laughs> you cannot be expected to do such a thing gratis. But I... 20 pounds. Well, that's all I get for twenty pounds. Is it just a just a feel? No, 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 no. If you want to go into the copulatorium thither with Frederica and a partner of your choice, you can source her to your heart's con. Tent. In I, I see. Well, uh, as I'm here, I suppose. Uh, yes, all right. I'll take. Uh, I'll take this one. Sir, that is more than my job is worth. If you want that kind of thing, I suggest you go to the Philippines. <laughs> all right. Well, I'll take. Uh, I'll take Frederica and this one. Very good, sir. Frederica and Colin. Through there, you have half an hour. <laughs> Colin? I won't tell a soul, sir. Discretion is my middle letter. <laughs> Mr. Dalliard, we have a three-way. Meet you at the peephole. 